Our top story tonight, a Stockton police officer killed while responding to a domestic violence incident. Officer Jimmy Inn was shot this morning outside of a home on La Cresta Way. Investigators said the suspect then tried to strangle an eight year old boy before a good Samaritan tackled him and another officer shot and killed the man. Officer Inn leaves behind a wife who's also a Stockton police officer and three children. And we've seen it time and time again. Domestic violence calls often put officers in risky situations. Oftentimes they have no idea what they're walking into. CBS 13's Anna Giles is live in Sacramento with experts who say this crime is on the rise, Anna. Yeah, the number of homicides and domestic violence cases in San Joaquin County has increased significantly during the pandemic. Officers are also more likely to face harm in domestic violence situations. A life lost in the line of duty. Stockton police officer Jimmy Inn walked into a situation experts call extremely dangerous and unpredictable. Officer shot. He's unresponsive for at least five to seven minutes. According to data from the State Department of Justice, more officers were assaulted when responding to a domestic disturbance call than any other type of activity, accounting for a third of all assaults on officers in 2019. Multiple shots fired, multiple shots fired. 2019 is the same year Officer Tara O'Sullivan of Sacramento was shot and killed while escorting a domestic violence victim. During the pandemic, San Joaquin County reported a 66% surge in homicides. The district attorney told us several months ago the violence stemmed primarily from domestic situations. So many of them were family driven. So much of the violence that we saw was between people who had some existing relationship. Creating a situation with high emotions and high risk for the officers involved. Yeah, and the U.S. Department of Justice also found that domestic disputes and domestic disturbances combined accounted for 40% of officer deaths over a five-year period. Anna, thank you. Stop